Hi everyone, it's Alicia with the Doherty Dozen and today we are at Costco for our monthly Costco haul for my family of 13. But first, coffee. <laughs> okay, I come once a month to a wholesale store, sometimes every three weeks, but I didn't get here last week, the kids were off school. We've gotta get all the things like the paper towels, the toilet paper, the tissues, the bottled waters, we drink a lot of bottled waters in my house. Um, the kids are always grabbing them to go to sports and this and that, and it's just convenient. And out, I need all the juice boxes. I need the Capri Sun, I need the Kool-Aid, I need Breeze juice boxes. It's gonna be, it's gonna be a big haul. So um, yeah, let's go. The secret of coming to Costco when it's not busy is to come middle of the week, 9.45, they say they open at 10, but they're gonna open those doors early. Mm-hmm, yep, that's when you come. Okay, let's go. Just wait for them to open. All right, I need some flatbeds. Flatbed one. <sighs> Remind me to get those for Zoe for her birthday. This is nice. I gotta send a picture of that to Josh. I love it. Ah, uh, patio furniture is making me like think that summer might actually happen. All right, I always start in the back with the bottled water. That stuff. Okay, I'm gonna look at the women's pants though, because Zoe still needs pants. I didn't get to that. She's technically like an extra small, but she can pull off a small. Oh, and these look, these look like they run small. This is like Capri, is it? No. Okay, these will work. Awesome. Okay, get her pan in black and green. These are so soft. I wish you could feel them. They're like, sad. like what material is this? It's so soft. She's going to love them. It doesn't say. Wait, there it is. This. Is oh nylon and spandex. Oh, that explains it. She'll like these. Do they have it in blue and a small? What color is the small tag? Yellow. There it is. Okay. Those are super cute and the perfect Zoe style. Wow, look at that shut. That's nice. I didn't know they sold Starbucks egg bites here. I'm gonna have to get some of those. I love those things. Okay, we gotta get the small ones while we're here. Hopefully, yep, they're right there. And are those the sports caps? Okay, there's the small ones. There's the 1.5 liters that James likes. Oh, there's the sports caps, okay.
that card's full, let's go leave it up front. Okay, leave that up front. Flat bed too. Okay, Gatorade next. This way. I'm gonna get some minis and some frost and some regular. I go through these ones the most, the minis, because I pack them in four lunches a day. Sean, Patrick, Jordan, Jason. So basically I need one a week plus people are gonna grab them just for a drink. So let's get an extra. Two of those. They don't drink those ones as much. Alright, 11 cases of Gatorade. I'm seeing if they have any of the water, the sparkling water. Um, hmm. They had it. It's like they don't have it every time. It's not a constant thing. I don't know if they run out of it. I don't really like the Kirkland sparkling water as much. Yeah, I don't see it. Alright, let me get Sunkissed for Dash and Bodhi. And then we'll go in the next aisle for juice boxes. people drinking those. Are those good? How have you tried them? There's Breeze apple juices, but pretty much everyone else has been drinking them lately and that's why we ran out early. So I'm gonna stack up this time. seems extreme but it's gotta last a month these ones are hard to find in other stores other than costco i had gotten her those mott's ones she did not like them all right capri sun and kool-aid from now on i am just donating the grape ones they just are stockpiling in my garage. Capri Sun. Okay, I always forget here. I want this. Two 
Okay, this one's full. Let's go put it up front. All right, they had me move my stuff over here by the registers more, the closed registers. Let's go out front and get another flatbed. Oh my gosh, look how pretty. I'm also definitely buying that for my car snack. Flatbed three. Okay, on this one, we're gonna get the paper towels, toilet paper, and tissue. Okay, so we walked in at 9.45. It's 10.20 and there's still not a line. Just for reference, if you're ever wondering when to come. Like, there's a lot of people here, but nobody's checking out yet. So if you just had one cart of stuff, you could be in and out of here in like 10, 15 minutes. All right, back to the very back corner. I was just in twice. I don't think we need bird seed. I think Josh just got some attractor supply. Start with paper towels. I like these Costco brand ones. We go through a lot of paper towels. A lot, a lot, a lot. Stock up. How am I supposed to get paper towels? Reach up. Hope it doesn't fall on my head. Okay, two. I'm trying to think of how many to get. Mm -hmm. I think I'm gonna get four. That's probably not gonna last the whole month, but I feel like that's good for now. I can always grab some at Walmart later in the well, March. It's almost March. All right, I also just get the Costco brand toilet paper. I realized I still need forks and spoons for packing our lunches. here and grab garbage bags. And I'm gonna grab some cups too. I like this size. I forgot to look, but I'm thinking I should grab Ziplocs while I'm here, especially the gallon ones. Gallons of blocks. Does this count as my workout for today? Is that the gallon? Yes. Okay. These. I can't fit too much more into this cart, so I'm just going to grab a couple things that I see on my way to put it up front. Okay. Now, in a paper cup that's microwavable. That's really funny because one of my kids said, why can't you just microwave it in the cup? And now you can. 
they read their mind. Okay, I'm gonna get two of these. This has been a go-to for Bodhi and Zoe lately. And grab Bodhi's Lucky Charms. want to forget about these PDA shares, so I'm going to get that now. Somewhere around here. It's not with the formula. I hope they didn't stop carrying it. Let me ask. Okay, FYI, Costco just moved their Pediasure over to, they put like all the protein drinks in the middle of the store. Um, yeah, so Bodhi likes the vanilla ones. Um, so I'm actually gonna get these on the next cart because I left my cart up front and yeah. There were a couple of us looking for it. We're like, where is the Pediasure? Anyways, I left my cart way over here, so. I'll just go set that up front and get a new one. All right, leave that front and get another one. I gotta tie my shoe. Here we go again. Flat bed four. Okay, first they had a Christmas waffle maker. Now they have a spring waffle maker. But. I already have the shamrock. I don't have the bunny. I have the heart. I don't have the bee. What's that one? Like a flower? I gotta look at this. Yeah, oh my gosh. Do I get it? It's $29.99. And it would make Waffle Wednesdays really exciting. We're getting it. I think I'm going to go to Target and do a Target haul for plates because it was a resounding recommendation to get the, I believe it's called Cor Corel. Am I saying the right brand? Anyways, the Corel brand bowls and stuff. Um, Cause they're like not heavy. And you guys had a really good point. You don't want super heavy plates with little kids carrying them through the kitchen. So yeah, we're gonna do a Target haul for that on a different day. And thank you for the recommendation. All right, I was glancing if they have any hangers here because I'm still on the hunt for hangers. The laundry hamper. Mm, no, I don't see hangers. I do see the muffin bites, but I only see the chocolate chip ones. And Bodie and Jordan like the birthday cake ones. Oh, wait, there's hangers. No, it's just like plastic hangers. No, I need a chocolate chip. Okay. birthday cake runs somewhere else today. I promised Bodie. Whenever you like promise my kids something, I try really hard to stick to that promise. All right, Bree and Patrick like these ones. I did run back to get these. Gosh, those look so good. I get these on the weekends. Um, when, what? These look ridiculous. I'm gonna get those for Josh. Okay, I get these egg bites on the weekends. Um, 
Zoe has violin and Harley has dance and we have like time to waste so we usually stop at Starbucks. Look at those macarons, look amazing. Snack time. I like the Nutella and those. Oh, and cereal bars. And the ice cream bars for the shy. Pistachios lately, so I'm gonna grab that too. Alright, so let's see. Still no popcorners. I guess we'll just get this multi pack. Yeah. Okay, I'm getting four boxes of those, which gives us a lot. We're gonna use these in the walking tacos for Tuesday, and then the rest will be for lunch, packing lunches. feeling done for today. I know there's more stuff I could get, but four flat buds is about my limit when it comes to checking out and loading it and unloading it. That's about all the van can hold. And it's a 15 passenger van. All right, I am smart this time. I'm getting one for me for car snack and one for the kids because they would steal my car snack. Still not really a line, maybe like people deep on a Tuesday at 11. We'll just scan most of this right on the flatbeds. Okay, we're all checked out. I'll show you the receipt in a minute. I'm gonna pull my van up and we'll load it in. And it is 11.15. Thank you. 
Okay, we are loaded in. Small world, um, the worker who helped me used to be James's and Alex's um, bus monitor attendant and lunch monitor attendant. He's like, I know you. That was a long time ago. I will show you when we get home how it's all loaded in here. But, uh, let's see if Alex can unload it for me. James has a driving lesson today, and Deshaun had knee surgery, so he's not able to help right now. Which I think is driving him crazy that he can't, like, do anything. All right, it is 11 23. Life in New York, you go somewhere with your heat on in your van and you go home with your air conditioner on. I forgot to put my car snacks in reach. That was a good haul. Four flatbeds is definitely the limit. I'm like walking out and I'm like, oh, I should have got the rails saws. And I'm like, no, I got nowhere else to put it. I didn't get pizza today. Normally I get the kids pizza, but. <sighs> we are pizzaed out. We did our annual pizza challenge um, on Friday. And then like, we had so much pizza. I got a large pizza. It ended up being from 11 different places, but one of them came late. So we had 11 large pizzas. And so all weekend long, I'm like, eat the pizza. You're not wasting pizza. Pizzas are a lot of money nowadays. So anyways, we are a little pizza now. Could take a little break from pizza. Although the kids did want to do make your own pizza night on Friday. Okay. I should have grabbed like a Gatorade or something. I gotta walk the dogs. It's gonna be a double workout day. Once I get some help, I get this unloaded. I'll show you where it all goes in our garage. We have like a shelf unit for the waters. We have four, I think, shelf units for the snacks. Paper towels I've just been like stacking up at the back of the garage and then the toilet paper I put in the bathrooms. Tissues I put in the bathrooms. What else did we get? Yeah, that's it. All right, I will see you in a minute. And here is today's receipt. Uh, here in New York we pay a deposit on bottles and cans and then you get them back when you recycle them or if you take them to the recycling center or back to the store if you just recycle them you don't get the five cents back we give them to nan and papa and they like to recycle them oh um and i finally remembered to use my rebate costco rebate check so i was pretty excited about that it's been floating around in my purse for a couple months so the total before the rebate check was 1240 and then after the rebate check was 990 not bad for four flatbeds. Like, that's crazy. Now we just need the kids to get home. And I forgot, Patrick is done with his ski season, so he can help. He's like a beast when it comes to carrying in groceries. He will carry in, like, that entire van full in five minutes. So, yeah, I'm going to wait for the kids to get home from school. I just got back from a walk, so just walk the dogs. It's a mess. But while I was doing that, um, James and Patrick brought everything in, and they are absolute rock stars. And look what they did. They put all the bottled waters away. And the Gatorades. Wait, can you see? Yes. Gatorades. So. The, oh, and the paper towels. And the toilet papers. And the tissues. Not the best. Anyways, we just got like a few things to put away. And we're like done. So if you're new here, this is our garage storage. Um, 
this house we quickly like filled up the indoor storage um so papa helped build all of this we got spare fridge freezers papa put up all these shelves papa's my father-in-law sorry josh's stepdad put up all these shelf units and he organized everything by like i know i am like so lucky in the in-law department you have no idea um so yeah organized it all and once a week after my main haul i like reface everything throw out the empty boxes you know the usual when you have teenagers bunch of stuff in the indoor pantry though I'm gonna bring some chips in I like to keep those inside I'm gonna bet we're gonna find some empty boxes here okay no no I mean there's like one in there and there's two in here but I don't want to combine them because they're different flavors Pistachios, I'm gonna put in the inside pantry. Forks and spoons inside, because I need them for packing lunches. The cereal goes in the inside pantry. So basically, whenever I get back from shopping, I stack everything by the garage door that's gonna go inside. guess what I forgot to get? The Nutella snack and goes. So now I still need to get birthday cake, muffin bites, and Nutella snack and goes. I'm going to wipe my later. those things I got at the dollar store yesterday hold on okay I got these at the dollar store yesterday and I'm gonna put the orange cups and fruit cups in them I need more of these. I don't know why I didn't buy more.
Yeah, I'm gonna have to get more of these. Okay, well, we got orange cups and we got fruit cups. I'm gonna need two more. Well, I had another one, but it's got the popcorn seasonings in it now. So then I can have one for the applesauce cups and the peach cups. I didn't realize I had so many peach cups. I really need to put that on the meal plan. There's a better way to put these in, isn't there? asking me why I don't organize this better and I'm like you don't know how my brain works it will take me like 20 hours because I'll organize it but then I'm gonna reorganize it and then I'm not gonna like the way that's organized so I'm gonna do it again yeah see that didn't even do anything Swelling in my mouth. That is why I need baskets because these things fall off of there and then they break open and then it's like, no. That was my slow mo. That was my slow mo, y'all. All right, these ones are all peach cups. And I will get a basket for tomorrow. Actually, maybe they have muffin bites. I didn't even look. The Dollar Tree have muffin bites? Nah, that doesn't seem like something they would have. Anyways, you dry erase on them what's in there. So then I'll have like, I can't even see, sorry. So then I'll have a shelf of these with like all the different fruit cup stuff. That's the plan. We're getting there. We're getting there. Did I just put that in the wrong one. Yes, I did. Okay, now I just gotta put the juice boxes away. That's it. So I am going to donate all these grape ones. Like. The one I'm just tired of them stockpiling. Nobody's gonna drink them. Oh, and these. Like nobody really drinks these. I'm just gonna donate these. That come in the multi-pack. Harley likes the berry. Crossing Capri Suns.
Josh is home. Well, he was home, and then he left for track, and now he's home again. Okay, I think that's it. I'm gonna donate this stuff, so yeah. Thanks for coming to Costco with me today. You are strong, you are beautiful, you are loved, you belong, and I'm so proud of you. I'll see you next time.